Hello everyone, True Boy here, welcome back to more Luigi's Mansion. Last time, we finished off what we had to do with uh, with that plant, getting our first gold diamond, and then we went, as we started to head toward Area 4, we the lightning struck the mansion causing the blackout, so we just turned it back, and we turned the power back on getting some speedy spirits that were only available during this time. Because I had to save, because I had to save and do it last time, the boo's back again, so, in this room here, the one that got away. So, we're gonna try again here. Probably not gonna get it, though. And, yep, it healed again like the other one, though, so... I just hit there and... The, nope, it, and it's gonna get away, because I'm not gonna get to it quick enough. I'm not getting that one for a while, but yeah, this key, this one opens up the way to this one here. However, examine this crate here. There's a speedy spear here. Oh, thank goodness, I thought I was gonna... I thought I messed it up there for a bit. Alright, so let's vacuum all this, vacuum up everything here, and yeah, if you examine some of the different, ex some of the different pieces of furniture here, you'll, you'll find like different ghosts and all, so you don't actually have, have to clear this room out though, but it's, of course, it's going to be helpful. Can I get that bill? Thank you. Okay, more money there. Yeah, you want to, you want to vacuum up all the dust over here. There is a quick way to get through the room, but you have to, but I'm going to try to, clear up the dust personally because there's well there's something we got it because there is something that we got it yeah because there's a boo in this room and clearing the dust will, will make it a little easier getting everything now but though you see one of those little pads there those little those little buttons of sorts that basically let you walk in the ceiling and such all right first off before we get the boo let's go ahead and get this key here actually yeah you were required to go to get this never mind this room's not option well, never mind. So you had to do that though, because you got a key to go up there. And all right, so is it maybe there. Nope, that's the fake. They get a. There's a gold bar there, so not gonna argue that. Okay, Boo got away there, but more money. Whoa, big heart there. Okay, remember this is for later. So it is fine. Fair Boo Rippities. Okay, go and sit in the wall, I guess. All right, so let's. Oh, oh come on! I was hoping to get back in there. And... I don't care about you two, but yep, I'm not getting those boos for a while. So what we're gonna do instead now is basically let's head back up to the where we got up to that telephone room, which is about where that was. So I'm gonna go on ahead up there. I'll meet y'all guys. I'll meet y'all up there in just a little bit. I'm back up here with the water element because I did because I did miss a couple of plants last time I was up here with the water element because I ran out of water before I get that before I can get everything there. But yeah, lightly holding the there, lightly holding the thing will, will actually let you, you use less water and so let, let let you be able to have use more than in there. So it'll so basically you can let it last longer that way. So. And that wasn't much I missed there. It looks like it was a gold bar there, but let's back in this telephone room here where we Where we had gotten the where we had gotten our clue about Uncle Grimlin first. You want to examine these little chests here Because now we got these little skeleton ghosts in here now. We haven't seen these guys in a while <laughs> All right, so Another room that's technically optional because we already have the key to get to the To get to the next room, but and I believe this room just gives you money, so but of course, what kind of player would I be if I don't go for everything, though? I'm more of a completionist. So I want to make sure I show as much as I can in this game. But yep. Yeah. Let's go ahead and get the money. A lot of it here. It's like I, I, all the usual. The Actually, I'm getting close. I'm close to a thousand. Over, get, breaking a thousand coins. If I hadn't lost that speedy spirit, I'd probably be even, close, I'd be even closer to that, though. But yep, there's a boo in this room, so. Oh, yeah. And yes, there. And yes, there was that little. There, so. We'll, we'll, we'll see. Is it, I didn't know it's a fake. Alright, so. Probably somewhere on this side there. Yep. And. I want you to look. Boomerang coming at you. And. First boo with a whopping 300 HP. 
All right, let's come on. Yeah, please go back in that room. Thank you. Okay, at least you, as long as he stays in the living room, I can I can keep chasing him to. I can keep I can, I, I can keep chasing him to the, the other parts there. But yeah, the, the booze are now getting even trickier. They're gonna take a while to get in. It seriously just went into that room. Well, I'm gonna be going over the mechanic of this room in a little bit though, cause the booze still hiding here. So let's come on, please. No. All right. Well, we're gonna be chasing this booze for a bit. I'll go over that. I'll go over what's up with that room in a little bit later. So let's see. I probably just get in the hallway right now. Let's see if I can lure it back over this way here. You for real. I'm not getting that boo for a while now. Oh, yeah. That's another annoying thing about an Area 4 is that you're going to be missing boos a good bit because of their high health. They can get away much easier. And you're going to be chasing them all over the place. But this room here, you got all these little toy soldier ghosts here. What you want to do is interact with all these little clocks in this room here. And Okay, gotta go around back this way to get the, okay, this one. And then, that'll cause all the toy soldiers to activate. And you can suck on the little wind up, on the little things, the, the wind up, the, the little the wind up screws. And then, get that one. Get the blue one last. The blue one is the one that drops the pearls. But they will all come after you, so you wanna be careful. Yeah, good. But, but yeah, you wanna get that blue one last because. Again, again, the blue one is the one that drops the pearls, and they those will attack you as you're trying to suck up the to suck up these three. But yeah, you have to catch three of them. Ow! Also, that's pretty, that's precisely why you want to save it for later. But but again, the one that matters isn't the one that matters is the blue one because he's the one that drops the pearls. So that's the one, so if you want a good rank on them. On these goes, that's the one you gotta worry about. Yep. These guys can be pretty tricky to get a gold rank on if you're not careful with that. They got you! I actually got a gold rank on them! But yeah, there's no key in this room or anything there. So it's just a matter of finding out where this boo is, first off, but. Let's see here. No, I'm on the wrong side. Where is that boo? Okay, got something there. Oh, there he is! Time for the six o'clock booze. Yep, the puns are getting are get the puns are getting even worse. I don't mind you going in that room at least though, because at least it's a lit room, so mm -hmm. yeah, the other one that's in there is a fake one, so let's get this one. And this actually is called the Booze Caster. You don't actually see the name of this one. And unless you actually trigger the conversation again later. I'm, I got caught on the thing I missed, so. Please. Thank you. Go back that way. I think as long as you're not sucking it up, it, it may go in a direct direction opposite of you. Don't hold me to that though. I could be entirely wrong and that could be entirely fake. I don't know But can I get this one? Can I at least get this one without much problems? Okay, so it went back into the toy room. So let's go back in there. We're, we're good Like I said get a oh, clockwork room. I'm sorry, but yep get used to it Like I said get used to that because you're gonna be seeing this a lot in this in this particular part of the game with all these high health HP and It got away just barely at 3 HP. Gotcha! There we go. Okay, that's one 300 HP boo down. So, but you may be wondering how we're going to do this now so because there's no key to go on. No. However, you may notice this one opened up after we beat those, those soldiers. So you want to take this and going up. And we are on the rooftop. And we got these shy guy ghosts up here around this little campfire here. All right, got 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 those, that that two in one. 
I got the again, another duo. There we go, gotcha. And let's get these two as well. Got two, got two sets of two, but you also want to pick up that fire element that's over there from the campfire. Because we got these ice ghosts here, so. And I got you as well, so let's. But yeah, we are actually on the rooftop. And it actually is required because there's a key up here. So let's head on up. Let's head on back over that over that way here. Let's go up this way. Climb this ladder here. You got. You actually have to hit the A button to interact with the ladder to to climb up. So, but got ourselves a key, and it's to that part of the of that of that area though. But we don't want to go down there just yet. Though. We want we don't want to go back over there yet though because. There, because notice that there's like a couple of chimneys over here, like we saw when we saw the mansion the first time. There's another one that's over to this way, to the right, and you want to go up this way, up to this ladder, and see that the wooden plank to the before. So, time to embrace our inner Santa Claus and go down the chimney. Welcome to the sealed room. And it didn't pop up. Wonderful. This room is a jerk because there is a gold, a random gold mouse in this room that p appears randomly. And also, that's not all. So, interact with that. There's also our last speedy spirit as well. So let's get that jewel there. How, however, I do want to show this gold mouse. So this could take me quite a while. So. But how do you get, but there's no way out of this room actually. So what you want to, but the thing is that there's no way out of the room and in fact you'll even see the boarded up door over here and you can't interact with that because you, you can't get out that way. You can't even burn down the, you can't even burn it down. If only it were that simple. So how do you get out? There's a function with the Game Boy Horror that I have yet to show. So I'm going to reveal a mirror and if you interact with the, if you search something with the, a mirror with the Game Boy Horror, it actually triggers a warp all the way back to the entrance. So yeah, this is gonna get irritating trying to show this last gold mouse. So I'll meet y'all ahead for when I finally get it to show up. Slight change in plans, actually. I'm gonna. I, I tried once again. I didn't get the gold mouse to show up. However, I want to go ahead and show. I want to go ahead and show now that since we got the key to this room here. What's over here in this room here? We got some stuff here. Because there's some stuff over here. Let's see here. Let's see here. Got a mirror back over here. So I don't think there's anything in this room because I think one of the last gold mouse and speed spear actually. So let's get these purple punchers out the way. Yes, that's really what they're called. Even though they look really, very pink to me. But yeah, a lot of money in this room. I think this way is technically optional because I think the ghost of the stuff this leads to is actually technically optional. Okay, I think there's. Careful with some of these though, because I think some of them do drop their maces, so. Let's see if there is something I'm missing in here. What am I missing? What am I missing in this room here? Oh, okay, there we go. So we got. Yeah, some of them will drop, like I said, some of them drop their maces down there and actually hurt you, but actually that does trigger some of the ghosts to appear. There we go. Let's end around with some more of these here. Yep, red grabbing ghost now, so yeah, that, that's what it is. I haven't played this portion of the game for a while, so I'm actually kind of semi-blind in this. And I got a gold ghost there. I think that may be it. No, it's not. Oh, yeah. 
What else am I missing then? Okay, we're gonna at least go into this room there instead. Okay, you wanna get this ice over here, so. Oh! Oi! You! With the mustache! Yeah, you! What do you think of me, jar collection then? Pretty amazing. Don't, don't you say? Wait, wait, we can't just let you look at him for free. Now, can we? No, I think not. If you be jars, you best beat me, challenge. You best challenge me first. Fine by me. It's on then. See how many you can freeze with that ice, boy -o. If you freeze me, then you win, right? Uh, then it's at the door with you. So, okay, so keep an eye out for this guy where he pops up. He pop up the bottom ones too. Okay. Right, so you can pop up in any of these jars here. And it gets a little faster each time, so you gotta be gotta be ready. Let's see, where else are you from? Or is it just these four that are here? I think it might just be these four. I think that was seven there. So scratch what I said before. Game's over, mate. And results are You got seven of me, boy. How could I lose? You made me feel refuge or myself, but maybe you better fancy getting stuffed in one of these jars. This is Jarvis. This is one of the, yep, obvious pun on the name. He's got this pretty fast as well, but he's he is an optional ghost, so you don't actually have to get him. And I actually got him. I actually got gold on him. Okay. Yeah, but it's just money here. Like I said, this path is technically optional, but if you want to get everything, you gotta go through these rooms here. Okay, so let's get the money here. Got a silver diamond. That's pretty sweet. And we got ourselves a boo, or probably two, and possibly even two, depending which one, depending where one of them escaped to. So let's look around and see where this boo's hiding. Where is this boo hiding? Somewhere in here, maybe? No, I think it. I think it moved. Who's shaking to tambourine? Okay, I'm a I'm a music person, and I didn't like that pun. Hey, but there's no way. Boomerang coming back at you. Okay, got his red gem there. Okay, he's probably gonna get away. So we finally found a couple of these ghosts that have alluded this before. Okay. Oh yeah. Where is this? What did I miss in this room? What did I seriously miss in this room? Oh, this one in the corner. Are you serious? That was it? You for real right now? Was I really that stupid? Whoa. Yes, I really was that stupid. All right, then. Well, th this actually may be a required room because we got ourselves another key here. So actually, we did need to go to this room. So we got. Let's see what we got here. Leads to some stuff down in the one of them down in the basement. Well, we got some boot. We got a boot hiding around here somewhere. So let's figure out where he is. Where is this boot hiding? No, that's a fake. I was probably in the right area the first time. So we're going back again. Underboo's making a comeback. And it went into that room here. At least, uh, at least it's all lit rooms now, so chasing them's gonna be a little easier now. Chasing these boos are gonna be a little easier now, so. you seriously in that wall? Okay, you're back there. You're back in this, into this, into the armory so here, so. Fortunately, the all, all this armor stuff makes it a little difficult to navigate the room e efficiently, so you can get the boo quickly. So at least we're gonna be able to get a bunch of stuff in this in, in this part in this part though. But I do need to get back to. But I do need to get back. I do need to get back to that sealed room there and try to get that one though. So. That's gonna take a little while though. Special bit of information for you. We already know about the triangular relationship of that. We already know. And we'll see what broke a thousand 
coins, actually, though. So let's... Who knows where that's going to land later on, though. But, yeah, we got... Both both those booze are probably in that clockworks room. So at least it'll take me back full circle over there. So... Alrighty, then. Let's see here. Got, got two of them hiding in here somewhere. Okay, no, that's not it. Okay, it's going to be in there. And... And there's boom... Boomerang, I return. You're seriously in the hallway again. Well, I'm going back over there anyway to get that to get the other one. So we're back here. So meet y'all back over there in a little bit, though. Like I said, th like I said, get used to seeing this in Area Four. Pick a room. I don't care which. There we go. I'll take it. So, like I said, this is going to be happening a lot in this area. So, it's probably one of the more annoying areas as a result of that. But. All right, come on. I would have rather you have gone back in that room. Okay. Rather than the hallway, but okay. Fine, whatever. Whatever. Whatever, 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 whatever. Alright. Yeah, go on ahead in the lit room. It'll be quicker. It'll be faster that way. At least I can get that one. At least I should be able to get that one pretty easily once I get over there. It's low enough on health. Of course, I say that now. Watch, I'm gonna lose it again. Watch, I'm betting on it. I am. Okay, thank goodness. All right, so there's another boo down. Again? You already told us about this, Egan. Really? Seriously? Because that the because you're talking the boo moved again. The, the other boo that escaped in here, tambourine. Okay, is it probably in here then, or is it in the? It moved. And now it moved, okay. Where are you hiding? Okay, come on. Tambu tambourine. Ah. Be here, I'll, I'll be right back. Pick a direction, I don't care. Okay. You chose that way. Very well then. You should went back to your original room, I see. Okay. At least I think this was the original room. Ow. Okay. It got out. No, it didn't. Okay. I thought it got out there for a second. Okay. I'll take it. Alrighty. So now we've got those booze. Now let's try the secret, the sealed room again. Oh, finally. I don't want to talk about how many times that it took me to finally get that gold mouse therapy. I'll probably flash on screen how many, how many more times after that I last cut off to tell you how many times it took. But we already got the speedy spirit here. But that gold mouse plus that speedy spirit, those actually are the last treasure ghosts in this game. Those are the last of their kind. So this room's a little bit of a treasure room as well. But so we'll, so we're going on. So good bit of money to get here in this room. So. And the, well, poison mushroom. Okay, didn't expect that. Get away from that. I wonder what would happen if I came up with a 
Okay, no, that, that wouldn't do anything. Yes, got the speedy spirit in there already. If there's one good thing about this room, is that there's no boo in this room. So, that's good to... So that, that's good, at least, though, because that would have been a pain if I had to constantly go back in here and get a boo. The game's not that mean. So, all the money here, but... More importantly, though, once we open up this one here, we get attacked by a bunch of ghosts. Let's go ahead and get you first, since you're the most annoying one. I, case in point, you're the most annoying. You for real right now, game? <laughs> wow! Get that money back before I... Got you! Get you out of here. And so I got that purple bomber. I said, so I got that purple bomber. There you are. There we go. Gotcha. And thank goodness I needed that heart there. Okay. Okay. But okay, got the, now we got this little key. Now we can get this key over here. Yep. So we actually, I think we did need to go into this room for anyway. So yes, yeah, another treasure room, but I think it is largely just a treasure room, though. So if memory serves correctly, the stuff beyond there, I think, is optional. Don't hold me to that, though. So let's. I've already shown this trick though. The first time we came here, I told about that though. So, but yeah, you, that actually works on any mirror in the mansion. So, a little shortcut there. But now we got that. This episode has gone on long enough. So next time. We're going to be exploring those rooms, those other rooms that we've opened up. Like that one, the one that's over there, and the ones that's down in the basement as well. So, until next time, see you guys then. Thank you all for watching.